Hi everyone, we hope you've had a great week. Today we want to talk a little bit about how we can have the same mindset of Christ and how we can put others above ourselves. So I want to read for you one of my favorite passages in the Bible. It's from the book of Philippians. A man named Paul wrote this and he says in chapter 2, he says, Therefore, if you have any encouragement from being united with Christ, if any comfort from his love, if any common sharing in the spirit, if any tenderness and compassion, then make my joy complete by being like-minded, having the same love, being one in spirit and of one mind. Do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit, rather in humility, value others above yourselves, looking not to your own interests, but each of you to the interests of others. In your relationships with one another, have the same mindset of Christ Jesus. So we have two different experiments we're going to show you today, and they'll hopefully show us how we can have that same mindset of Christ Jesus. We're going to start with these two glasses and fill them with water. The first glass we're going to fill with cold water, and we're going to fill it all the way up to the top. The second glass we're going to fill with hot water. Because they look the same, we're going to add some food coloring as well. So blue is going to go into the cold water, and red is going to go into the hot water. You can see those colors mixing in. Now we're going to try to mix them. Um, but in order to get them to mix, we have to stack them on top of each other. So I'm going to put a card on top of the hot water, and then we're going to flip it on top of the cold water. Now, what do you think will happen when I pull the card out? So if you look here, you can tell that the hot water on top did not even mix with the cold water, even when he took the card out. Um, so this is an example of what God did not want us to do. He does not want us to think that we're better than other people. He does not want us to be separate. We just read in, in Philippians that he wants us to have the same mind and the same spirit and the same love. Sometimes we think we're better than other people. Sometimes... Um, we think that we know better and we just want to do our own thing. Um, but this is an example. The hot water wants to rise and be on top um, and they're not mixing. So now we're going to try the experiment again. But this time we're going to try to put the cold water on top and see what happens. So we're doing the same thing. We'll put the hot water in one of the glasses and fill it all the way up to the top. And then we'll add cold water in the other glass. And to help us see the difference, we'll add red food coloring again to the hot water. And blue food coloring to the cold water. To mix them, we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to put the cold water on top of the hot water. So if I flip the cold water, on top of the hot water. We'll see what happens again when we pull the card out between the two cups. So we can see this time when we put the cold water on top, they actually came together instead of saying separate. And it's, it's kind of dark, but they actually make a new color. They make purple. So when we talk about having the same mindset of Christ Jesus, like Paul talked about in Philippians, it later goes on to say how Jesus was up in heaven and he was perfect. And Jesus came down to earth. He made himself nothing. He humbled himself to come down to earth to be with us and to die on a cross for us. 
So this week, we just challenge you to try to have the same mindset of Jesus. Try to think of other people better than yourselves. Try to find ways that you can serve other people. So that way we're not separate. We don't think we're better than other people or want to do our own thing. But we're coming together to work with other people. Because if you're Christian, you believe in Jesus. We all have the same goal of other, as other Christians. We all want to share Jesus' name with other people. Um, so this week, we just challenge you, try to have the same mindset of Christ Jesus. We hope you have a wonderful week.